and we had a warm Friday, and we have a picture of a dog with burned paw pads that has been circulating on social media. Yeah, and it's now raising questions about the safety of your pets during the summer. Channel 3's Caroline Corgan sat down with a local veterinarian who says this can happen in just a matter of minutes. On the first day of summer, you will find tons of people walking their dogs near Coolidge Park. But with the summer sun comes the heat, which can burn your pet's paw pads. It's a concern for many people after this photo started circulating on social media. It shows a dog's paw pads burned after going for a walk on hot pavement in Washington. Hello, girl. Dr. Randy Hammond is a vet at the Northgate Animal Hospital in Hickson. These pads are what's going to blister. He says it's one of the biggest issues they see during the summer. Anything that's reflective, asphalt, dirt, sand, can really heat up uh, and, and really can become amazingly hot. Uh, we'll get temperatures on the sidewalks in the summer as high as 160 degrees. So the pets will end up burning their pads and a lot of times it may be a day or two afterwards that you realize that you know the pet's got a problem. Hammond says it's best to walk your dog during the early morning or evening when it's cooler. Wait till it cools off some, you know, because they are heat exchangers and that can that can be a, an issue. He says that includes leaving your dogs in a hot car. This time of year, they can heat up in minutes. So, you know, my recommendation is never end up leaving your pet in a, a closed car during the summer unless you're in there with them and the air conditioning is running. In Chattanooga, Caroline Corgan, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.